What's up, guys? It's your boy Chris Nigga back here on video today. We're going to bring back, not bring back, but start again the Pacific 2 car review videos. I feel like I've been neglecting Pacific 2. Let's do some Pacific 2. Let, let's put Mango to the side a little bit. Pacific 2 is more, way more important. And I like the game way better than Warning Greenville. Let's be honest. Greenville's it's pretty good, but um, the revamp is taking too long, so I'm losing care for it. The game entirely. So, let's continue with what we're doing today. We're reviewing a bunch of freaking cars. We are not reviewing just one. We're going to review two vehicles. Actually, we're reviewing three vehicles. We're going to be reviewing the Oxford A150 series. This includes every version of it. So, we're going to review all that in one video. So, let's do this. Alright, so, the first thing we're going to look at, the first of this truck, we got, there are three different uh, uh, models, uh, three different trims. You have the F5, A550, A150 diesel, and then a regular A150. So, we'll look at the regular one first, obviously. We'll go up from diesel to Super Duty. So, also, um, fun pointer, a fun fact, if you guys do not know what a Super Duty truck is, a Super Duty truck is basically a work truck you see in construction sites sometimes. They're basically house pullers or whatever. They're made to pull a lot, a lot, a lot of weight. So, that's what they're made for. That's why they got the big wheels in the back and stuff. So, here it is. This is the regular, plain Oxford A550. This is the plain one right here. Alright? This is nothing special. Good old plain Oxford right here. I'm going to take a thumbnail picture right now, guys, if you guys don't mind. Um, don't worry, you guys can see this. All right. Let me copy and paste that picture to where I want it to be. Um, you guys don't, you guys can't see what I'm doing on here, so it's fine. All right. So here is a normal Oxford A550, the normal standard version you can get, by the way. Um, Oxford... Uh, A550, A550 trucks series, all of them, are Game Pass exclusives. So if you guys actually do want to drive this truck around and stuff, you need to have the, the Game Pass. Um, the, I'll show, I'll be a link in the description of the name of the Game Pass you need to get, because there are other Game Pass for other cars in this game. So basically, guys, anything below, okay, anything below car collection series, right? Anything below that. Anything, right? Anything is Game Pass, like Super Series One, Car Collection Series Two. They're all Game Passes. Also, if you guys do have all the Game Passes, like, um, like me, I want you guys to know that you do, you guys do should keep your heads up. There is a new luxury pass coming with new luxury vehicles to the game. To the game, this game's getting even better. Um, Greenville, just need to start keeping up. <laughs> so. Let's look at this basic so basic truck stuff. Now, you can clearly tell this is like Toyota Tundra F. Basically, it has a Nissan Titan lights, F-150 frame and body, and Toyota Tundra headlights and like grill, kind of. Not really, kind of. A little bit. Oh, man, sorry, my eye guys. Sorry about that. We go over here, guys, and we look up this truck, and it looks amazing. Look at the beautiful just craftsmanship up, up in here. You got the, the I don't know these things do. On the nice Oxford symbol right there, this grill looks amazing. I like the mirrors here. It's a short four door truck, short bed truck. All the trucks, all the Oxfords we're gonna look at today in this video are all four doors, no no double cap. So sorry about that. Let's get in this thing. The starting off, it don't it don't sound crazy. It don't sound like oh my god, these are like monumental things, monumental crap right here, right? No, 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 no. So you get in the car, right? So we're gonna drive. So you can clearly see where the thing is going. So so far, it drives pretty good. You guys can kind of see where this is going. Um, it has daytime running lights. All the cars in this game do. All the cars, trucks have daytime running lights in this game, and it looks beautiful. Oh crap, wrong way. Turning signal, guys. Our truck out here looking beautiful. 
You guys can really see it shine as I'm driving around. You guys get to see this thing shine in all its glory. So, this thing's actually pretty um, nimble for a truck. Um, accelerates pretty good. Now, another trick I want to show you guys. You hit P, which is the parking brake, and hold down the brake button. You can keep your brake lights on. A little trick I... You know, that's basically this game substitute for manual. So it doesn't have manual transmission. Oh. Alright, so we just got another skill. So, I know what's going on here. Let's see. I'm going to slam the gas. Alright, I'm slamming the gas. Now, honestly, the truck is no, you know, sports truck. Alright, the, uh, the other pickup truck that's free, that's no game, no key passes needed, that truck is faster. Alright, it is. Um, this thing is more for bigger pulling more heavy stuff things like that so I'm gonna have him slam the gas and really get going here but I'm actually gonna drive to the park um so we're gonna go ahead and do that and drive to the park so we'll go ahead and drive to the park be careful um you don't want to fall off these things these hills over here could be a pain in the butt to try to get back up. Like, get it. Like, literally, it's a pain in the butt to get back up these little health things. You're gonna have to despawn your vehicle and respawn it again. Like, it's that bad. So, here are the lights, by the way. Pretty cool. Again, this game looks so beautiful. Again, right now, because I'm on a more on my laptop, which is more powerful than my PC at home, my desktop, um, this is on max graphics. This is on the highest graphics setting you can go in this game. And my computer is handling it perfectly. No lag, nothing. So, I'm going to go straight up. Straight up. Hold on, let me, hold up. Let me take this picture here. Um, oh, crap. No, no, no. We just took the screenshot. Let's open it up real quick. I'm going to put it in where I want to put it into the um hold up guys don't worry we're, we're getting there we'll get to the next the, the other vehicles just let me do this real quick guys just let me handle my business all right so we're gonna go over here to turn the lights on real quick because it is getting dark in the game let's park oh we can't park there it's a handicap spot we can park here Alright, so this truck overall looks amazing. It drives amazing. It's a great truck. I really it is. Alright, so we got out the way. Let's look at the next um, series of this truck, which will be the diesel version. So we got the diesel version right here. This, my friends, is the diesel version right here. It's the same truck up on stilts. The grill is actually the color of the truck. So that's another cool thing, right? So looking pretty cool. Now you can notice the truck sounds different. This, now you know this truck is it's just on still. It sounds completely different. We got a diesel, probably a diesel V8 engine in there. Um, so it, it, it's gonna sound good. It's a diesel, diesel engine. So diesel engine sounds completely different than a V from a V6. Now when it comes to driving this thing, guys, you need to be more careful because this thing suspension is a lot. Sorry um, this thing, oh, suspension, for some unknown reason, is softer, or squishier, and it has way more body roll, so you're going to have to be quite careful. I recommend really being careful, guys. You don't want to be rolling over getting stuck, guys, on the rocks and stuff. You don't want that to be happening. And again, be careful, guys. This truck can tip over. I've done it before, so be careful, guys. Be careful. That's all I'm saying. Oh, be like what you just saw happen to me just now. Be careful. It's hard, right? It can be tough sometimes. Be careful. All right. Be careful, guys. Be really careful. All right. Be careful. All right. So I want to stop here. And the truck is really nice. It, it drives really great. I love it. Um. Let's let's look at us go over here.
So real quick, um, I do want to show you guys the last series of this truck. That is the F550, the A550, which we won't show. We won't go too much crazy over. Um, here it is. Now, honestly, you can tell they have my lights, and it has lights on the mirror and the top of the truck here. So I hit Z. Boom! Look at that. You can see it sounds different around similar to this diesel engine. It's around the same. Looks pretty different, doesn't it, guys? Um, you guys can see the big thin wheels in the front and big, you know, bulky wheels in the back. Pretty cool setup we got here, guys. Can we make it in here? Let's see if we can. So again, guys, this truck is again super duty. You get the big wheels in the back, big freaking honka wheels in the back. Look at that. And the wheels are different in the front. It's the, this is thing is for full on towing. I mean, the towing a house or something, you know? House puller, you know? That's what this thing is for. So, great truck. Personally, for me, guys, out, out of all three of them, the A550 is my favorite of the three. And let me know in the comment section which one you like the best. Please subscribe, hit the subscribe button for me. Kind of agree, kind of a fun thing you gotta do. Drop a like, comment, share the video with your friends and family. I'll see you guys in the next video. Peace.